Hey everyone! Um, so it's been a while since I've filmed, if you can probably tell. I am now 22 weeks pregnant. Uh, Kyle and I have been wanting to film videos, like baby hauls and different stuff, but he's at work and school a lot of the time, and when we finally get time for each other, we usually just spend it loving each other, so. I figure I could film this one without him. It's a maternity shopping haul, and at first I was very nervous to buy maternity clothes. I didn't want to waste money. I felt kind of selfish buying a whole bunch of new clothes, but then I realized I didn't fit in any of my clothes anymore, and trying to fit in my old clothes is very uncomfortable. And I deserve it, I'm growing a baby, so Kyle was on the same page as me, luckily. So, I'm gonna go over some of the fun stuff I bought with you guys, and we'll start with this. This I wasn't super in love with, it's from Kohl's, but it, I, it was on clearance, it was like seven or eight bucks, and it's by Oh Baby by Motherhood. And I'm gonna be pregnant in fall and winter, so I feel like, yeah, I'll get good use out of this. It's soft, it's got the ruching on the sides, but that's the first thing. Next is this top. This is also from Kohl's. This one is so soft, like literally so soft, <laughs> but it's been too warm to wear, but once it's a little cooler out, I feel like this will be super cute with maybe some ankle boots and jeans and maybe a hat. This one was $12, it's by Dana Buckman. And cute, I like it. This now is not maternity. It is just regular women's. But it, it's from Marshalls. My sister got one and I loved it. It's got the skinny sleeves and then the kind of draping, draping down the front, which I feel like will be really flattering in the later months and super cute still. I have some stuff from Target. This is a t-shirt from Target. I thought I would be able to wear my old t-shirts because I have some longer t-shirts, but no, it's not the case. They come to like here. The belly gets bigger than you realize. <laughs> and they come to like right here and I have like my belly hanging out and I feel a little bit like Homer Simpson, so I would say invest in some t-shirts. This was like $13 on clearance at Target. And I also got it in white. It has the ruching on the side, but it's super lightweight and comfy. And lightweight is nice because I've been super hot while pregnant. Like, seriously. I have these maternity jeans from Target. I love these. They're just regular skinny jeans. But then they have the cool elastic band that goes around your stomach. And this is actually really comfortable. Like, I think I'll probably wear these after the baby comes. <laughs> For at least the first couple months. I could probably get away with it. And these were... These were 35. They're not the right size, but they had a denim deal going on, so I bought them. And then I plan to go exchange them. This is from Destination Maternity, this store here. Never been there before, but I loved it. The staff is really helpful, especially when you're nervous buying maternity clothes because you've never done it, which I was. This is just a long maxi skirt, super soft. They know that women who are pregnant want soft, lightweight materials because this is so nice. And I feel like I could wear this after the baby too. Just maybe roll the, the waistband. But super cute, 30 bucks. This one is also from Destination Maternity. It's by Motherhood, and it was on clearance for $13. It doesn't look as cute not on, but when I tried it on, it was really cute. And again, the super soft material, got the ruching, and I think I'll wear this. This is cute. Okay, next were these leggings from Destination Maternity. They were on clearance for $19.97. They are see-through. So I'll probably wear them under my old dresses, like wear some old dresses as tops, and then wear these so that no one can see my butt. And then it also has the comfy elastic band, which I love, 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 love. And then we have these, which my sister found. They were on the clearance rack as well. My sister is a very good bargain shopper, so it came in handy. These were $22.97. They're 
They're by Motherhood. Must be a popular brand. And they have the elastic band, which I love. Cute skinny leg, floral design. Love these. I want to find a cute gray top to go with them. Because I feel like we could get some good pictures in those. And then for the fun stuff, this is what pulled me into Destination Maternity. One of the first signs of my pregnancy was getting larger. Oh, there goes my phone. Was getting larger breasts, which I've always had small ones, so I was like, hey, this is cool. But then once I stopped fitting my bras, and it's so hot right now, it's been like around 100 for the past week, it's like, you don't want to wear too tight of a bra. No, thank you. So, I, with my sister's help, I pushed myself to go get bras. And this is the first one. The lady who works there measured me, which I've never done because I'm shy. And she said it was a 34D. I'm usually a 34A or B. So I started laughing and she's like, no, it sounds weird, but you know, you grow a lot with the milk production and you're probably gonna grow a little more. And I'm like, what? But I tried this on, this is a 34D. And she was right, it fits. So it's by Notori and it's a 34D. For $72. This one was the most expensive, but it was buy three bras, get one free, so I ended up saving like $30, so it was okay. And this one has the little buckle, so when the baby's here I can easily breastfeed, which I think is super nice. It's got the underwire, which is good for right now. I have this one. It is by a pea in the pod and I've worn this one this one's actually 34 C I was between the 34 C and the 34 D but I wanted a little more cleavage with the bra because that one that I just showed it doesn't have as much cleavage and sometimes I want to look a little sexy for my man gotta keep it spicy so I went with the C um, I could probably wear this more so now and then probably less towards the end of the pregnancy but it also has the buckles, love it, super nice. It was nice to have a store that I could go try all this on in because I would have totally bought the wrong sizes if I shopped online. It was it was way different than I <laughs> thought it would be. And then this one, it is by Motherhood, which I've seen this one on line a lot. A lot of women said that they liked this one. So I was glad that I was able to try it on and it's just as comfy as everyone says it is. It's got the little buckles, and I think this one will be really nice for when the baby comes. I'll just want cozy bras on. Even now, this is nice for just a cozy bra, but I really like this one. And this one was 25 And then the last one is this one. It's really soft cotton, I think, and it's by a Pea in the Pod as well. And she said, uh, the lady that worked there said she wore this when she had the baby. And it's really convenient to just pull out your boob for feeding. And then you're not just totally bare. At least you have something covering. So I feel like this will be really nice for at the hospital right after I have the baby. And then switch it between this one and this one for the first, who knows, probably a while. I've heard it's a while that you can't wear underwire. But that was all of my maternity stuff. I hope you guys liked it. And I will probably do a style video, a maternity style video, while I'm wearing different outfits so that you guys can see different stuff and then I'll edit it all together because I think it's fun to use your baby bump as an accessory and I think pregnant women are beautiful. So this is my bump now at 22 weeks and I'm feeling the baby kick, so is Kyle, and we are just loving this. So I will probably see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.